Welcome back to uh, Dragon Quest XI. We uh, just jumped. We met a new friend, jumped off a cliff, and ended up in a church after being chased by a dragon and knight. Let's get going. Huh. Nice little church you got here. Ah, there you are, my children. I trust that your friend here is fully recovered. Yep. Oh, don't worry about him. He's just fine. Hey, thanks for looking out for us. We owe you one. Not at all, dear. I'm just happy to see you both well again. But if you are leaving, you must be careful on the road. Oh? It seems some dangerous criminals have escaped from the capital and are at large somewhere in the area. Oh, I shudder to think what wicked deeds they might be capable of. Yeah, wicked deeds. I don't know what we, I, they could be doing. There's nothing we, or I mean they, would possibly harming all the woman like uh, you. Ding. Criminals, you say? Dear me, that doesn't sound good. And you heard this when you were in Heliodor. I did indeed, my child. There were guards everywhere. They are searching high and low for the villains. Oh dear. And I heard that the mighty knight Sir Hendrik himself has headed to the mountains in the south with his troops. They say he means to block the road to Cobblestone, the village the fugitives came from. That's not good. <laughs> oh, but you must forgive me, poor lambs. I did not mean to alarm you. They will soon be caught, I am sure. Justice will be done. And until then, you are free to remain with us for as long as you please. Thanks. We appreciate that. Um, we're going to get a little fresh air. We have a few things to discuss, right? Yes, discuss. And not be fugitives uh, hunted down by the law. Did I convince her? Ah, yeah. La la la. Cobblestone, eh? Never heard of the place. Talking I never guys. even knew anyone actually lived in those mountains down south. Is that really where you're from? Nice place. Good view of the mountain. They make us climb a big rock to uh, become adults. I'm guessing you want to go see what's happening down there. But you need to be smart. You won't get past Hendrik unnoticed. Ah. If you're going to make it there without getting caught, you'll need to avoid the main road. Yeah. And if you won't do that, you'll need my help. I know every back road there is to know in these parts. Huh. But I've got things to take care of in Heliodor first. I left a little something in one of my old haunts downtown, and I need to get it back. Alright, let's get it back. So, are you coming along for the ride? I did help you break out of that dungeon, remember? Yeah, yes. That's the spirit. But we can't have you bringing us any unwanted attention. Ah, I've got just the thing. Here, put this on and keep your face hidden. Otherwise, you're gonna get nabbed as soon as you set foot in Heliodor. Like a hug will help. Ha! <laughs> That's more like it. If you're gonna be a wanted man, you might as well look the part. Right. Surely won't see Let's through this five feet town. away. Glad you're coming along. 
The seer told me to stick with the luminary when I found him, and that's just what I'm going to do. Yay. They make a friend. Perfect. Right. Okay. Time to go on a murder kill spree. Is there a bell around here? Looks like we're on foot. Murder kill! Is that a goblin? Yeah, you go down first. I'm sorry, you did what now? Well, you can just go straight to hell. And you for good measure. Take that. Ha! Huh. Easy! Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Get rid of you. Take that. Level up! Yay! 67! Good. Uh... No, there's nothing. Murder kill! The best kind of kill, because it involves murder. Take that! Take that! Ah, 
I am on a rampage. To... I to which has never been seen before. Another one bites the dust. Yes, it does. Ooh, where did that fall from? Mega curbs. Ah, you. Get rid of you before you call more. Take that. Huh. Easy. Yes, it was. And you're easy too. Take that. Take that. Ah. The heck? Get up already! You're going to pay for that. Take this. Another one bites the dust. Yep. Aha! Five is six. Good for you. No. A sparkle tree. Huh. Ah, there's no murder kills. All right. Sparkly! Disappears when you Okay. Nah, I'm already Okay. Welcome to downtown Heliodor, home to rogues, ruffians, and all my other favorite kinds of people. Yay. About a year ago, me and Dirk, my partner in crime, managed to uh, acquire one of the royal family's most precious possessions, the Red Orb. The re they got wise and pulled me in eventually, but not before we'd stashed it somewhere safe so we could pick it up later. Huh. Right down there is the biggest, stinkingest garbage pile in all of Heliodor. Me and Dirk buried the orb slap bang in the middle of it. Huh. After all, no one would ever think of looking for it there. We're criminal geniuses, I tell you. Stay a too big away from me, criminal genius. I can smell you from here. Time to go liberate that loot to the garbage pile. If we must. Watch this.
And there's the night time. Oh well. There it is. This is the spot. Keep a lookout, okay? I'm going to grab the loot. Now, it was around here somewhere. It's definitely here. I'm a thousand percent sure. Sure you are. Uh, it's not here. You gotta be kidding me. Me and Dirk were the only ones who knew where it was. Wait a minute. That rat! He must have done the dirty on me and taken it for himself! Damn it! I should have known! The thieving little... Wait till I get my hands on it! I'm gonna find him. And you're gonna help me. Okay. The inn we used to crash at is just over there. Come on, it's the only one with an upstairs. You can't miss it. That building right there. Got it. Hello? <laughs> this old place hasn't changed a bit. Back in our thieving days, Dirk and me used to lay low here whenever things got hairy. Ruby? Ruby, you there? It's me, Eric. There's something I need to ask you. Ruby runs the place. Looks like she's not around, but if anyone knows where Dirk is, it's her. Uh-huh. Which means we'll have to go find her. Great. So here's the plan. There's a tower they use to look out for fires. You're going to climb up there and keep an eye out for Rudy. I'll check a couple of other spots. Don't worry, you can't miss her. She's the only redhead in town. And you're the only blue-haired one, I assume. Wait, Ray, are we talking about a... Rag, rag, or yellow, orange. Yeah, she just walked by, let's go. You saw her heading back to the inn? Great! Let's head over there, find out what she knows. Good. If 
that isn't my favorite landlady. Welcome to our humble... <gasps> Strike a light! If it ain't me favorite Lord Tearleaf! Last I heard, they'd locked you up and thrown away the key! Yeah... Hang about. You've gone and escaped, ain't ya? You and your friend here are the fugitives everyone's talking about! Yeah, nothing gets past you, does it? Well, I know not to stick me big nose in where it ain't wanted. You always did like to sail close to the wind. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't be here long. I just need to know where Dirk is. Have you seen him? Dirk, eh? Now there's a name I ain't heard in a while. Didn't he open some fancy shop up by the castle? Yeah, that was it. Raking in the cash he is, or so they say. That can't be right. The rent up there's crazy. Will he find the money? He sold the thing, you Nimrod. Wait a second. He sold it, didn't he? The rat sold the damned orb! Look, in this part of town you don't go asking too many questions, you know that. If you want more, you'll have to get it from the horse's mouth. You're right. Thanks, Ruby. I appreciate it. We'll get out of your head. No good traitor! I'll bet he sold me out and sold the orb. And all so he could move up in the world. Well, I'll get what I'm owed. You'll see. But we'll need to get past that sentry if we're gonna head uptown and find him. Wait, isn't he... Hearing that one of the guards is terrified of dogs. Yep. Hello, little girl. Can we borrow your dog? Nice one, boys. I that great big heart of a dog. Really weed himself in when he saw you. What you think you're staring at? Yeah, get lost. You what? You want to borrow me, dog? You're having a giraffe, ain't you? Look, I ain't got time for this. Go on, just look. What was that? Here's. Where's the shop? Uh. Armor shop. Well, maybe. I'll get those later. Welcome to all that cough cough music. There we go.
Alright, now where is that girl? Actually, you know what? Let's armor up a bit, just to be sure. Okay, we're all set up. Now let's find the girl and get going. Leads to the nice part of town. Oh, screw My you. job is to protect respectable people from being bothered by rabble and riffraff. In other words, you. You're not much of a looker either, buddy. <laughs> ah! No, no, not a, a, a dog. Anything like that. <laughs> Word like a charm. Now to head up to where all the rich folks live and find out what the heck Dirk thinks he's up to. Okay, let's go. Find the house. I'm tired of walking. Assassin's Creed, you ain't, but gets the job done. Ah, that looks like a shop. place you got here. Welcome, welcome. Feel free to browse. You'll find we only stock the very finest wares. <gasps> That's good. Because I'm looking for something very special indeed. Happen to have any orbs in stock? He's pissed. Uh, Eric! Long time no see, old pal. Eric! My, 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 my,
it's all, oh, it's really good. You, larger than life and good, oh, fine infant. I'm so oh, happy to see you. You have no shame, huh? But your backstabbing has off of me. Ugh. You always were full of it, Dirk. But this really takes the cake. Admit it. You sold me out and sold the orb so you could buy this place, didn't you? I never! I promise you, I never sold you out. I was worried sick about you. I only opened this place to try and help you. Oh, yeah. And how does that work, exactly? How does you opening this place and lining your pockets while I rot in jail help me? Uh, yeah, how? Look, I was never much of a thief, you know that. But it turns out I know how to sell stuff. I got a gift, even if I do say so myself. <sighs> when you got nabbed, I spent months racking my brains for ways of busting you out. I couldn't stand the thought of you being in there. Well, at least you can cigarette. In the end, I realized I'd have to give up the orb. I took it to the king, told him I found it somewhere, and pocketed the reward. Then I used the cash to open up the shop here, and poured all my profits into bribing the guard up at the castle so they'd let you escape. Hmm, now that you mention it, I did think it was weird they never tossed my cell the whole time I was digging that hole. Exactly! I was paying them to turn a blind eye, weren't I? You're a good friend. <laughs> <sighs> okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I doubted you, partner. That's the spirit! Eric, old pal, it's so good to have you back. But I need that orb. And now we don't even know where it is. That's about a problem. <laughs> oh, yes we do. Right this way, gentlemen. Ah, there he is. So, where is it? After I handed over the orb, I made sure to keep my ears to the ground about where it ended up. I knew it was important to you, see? Uh-huh. Well, a little bird tells me that Hendrik and his men took it to the King's Arrow. And it's been under lock and key there ever since. The King's Barrow, huh? Mm -hmm. That's southeast of town. Same direction as Cobblestone. Which means we can kill two birds with one stone. You coming, Dirk? A little adventure for old time's sake? Sorry, no can do. I got a shop to run. I'm a married man these days. Married? Wow, you really have changed. Well, you always said you wanted to settle down and maybe go into business someday. I'm happy for you. We'd better get going. Take care, Dirk. And thanks for everything. You too, old pal. Be lucky, eh? And don't you two go doing anything I wouldn't do.
The south gate is crawling with guards. We won't be walking up that way. And Hendrick's men are too uptight to take bribes. Guess we'll have to go the long way round. If we skirt round the hills to the south, we should be able to approach the King Sparrow from the other side. We can drop into cobblestone on the way. Okay, let's head back downtown. Watch yourselves out there, eh? They don't call that forest round there the mangle grove for nothing. There's plenty going there and never come out. Right. <laughs> It'll take more than a few kids' stories to scare us off. Besides, it's the only way to get there. I have to go all the way around, right? Yeah, how's it going? Hey. Uh... <laughs> Suffer, you punk. I'm gonna buy a few herbs for Eric. You stay out of here. Got it. Any sign of them? No, nothing. Let's search the town again. Those lights? You're pretty keen to find us, huh? You better steer clear of Heliodor until the heat dies down. All right, through the Mangle Grove and onto Cobblestone. Let's do this. Actually, I'm going to the church.
And that's where we'll take things for today. Thank you so much for watching. Next time we travel through a forest and we'll come across the first boss fight. Yeah, I, I'm almost to the point where I ha don't know what's going to happen yet, but you, I'll explain when we get to there. But anyway, if you like this video, like it, subscribe if you want. I don't know why, but go ahead and I will see you next time.